Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of fetal bilateral hydrocele. This is a very common case in your regular practice. So let's talk about it. A young female patient came with a full term pregnancy and labor pain. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the fetal scrotal region. You can see two ecogenic testes here. This is the midline raphe, and you can see anechoic areas around these testes. These anechoic areas are nothing but bilateral hydrocele. You even can see epididymis here. Let's magnify a little. Here you can see the hydrocele quite well. Both testes are of similar ecogenicity and size. That is very important. You even can detect testicular torsion at intrauterine period, where you will see the asymmetry of the testes with enlargement and swelling on the torsion side. Another magnified image, and you can see the testes and bilateral hydrocele. This is the epididymis, and this is the midline raphe. Here's a still picture. You can see two testes and hydrocyl. And then magnified images, and you can see bilateral mild hydrocyl. So, in summary, mild fluid collection is noted in bilateral hemiscrotal sacs indicating fetal bilateral hydrocyl. Now the take home message. Fetal hydrocele often result from a patent processus vaginalis. This is usually unilateral, but you may get bilateral like our case. Most cases are transient. You can get them at third trimester and it will get resolved at birth. So don't make your patient frightened. Assure them that this case is usually transient in third trimester. And don't forget to check the presence of testis within the hemiscrotal sacs while seeing hydrocele. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and visit imagingstudy.com for more cases. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.